One of my favorite all-time ab exercises is the weighted low tuck. Now, the reason is, basically with any ab exercise, you've got all these different types of things that the abs do, right? So you've got your flexion, you've got extension, you've got your twisting, you've got your side bending, you've got all these different motions that happen. And one of the best ones that I, I, I think really helps is learning how to keep the rib and hip connection tight. All right, so thinking this whole section here, pretty much from like say mid quad to like your chest, learning how to lock all that in as one piece, getting your lats involved, getting your you know your hip flexors and your glutes and your core and everything just locked in, right? I think that's a really, really good way to be really strong in your core, not only for lifting weights, but for sports and stuff as well. So the weight of the hollow tuck is one of my favorites. You'll see as I'm demoing, I'm really keeping my lower back stuck to the ground. So I'm rolling up, my ribs are directing towards my hips, so I've got a really hard contraction of my abs. And as I'm extending out with, with my arms and my legs, there's no shift in my in my core. Like I'm not like arching back and, and breaking in that core. So that's a key point for the hollow tuck that makes a big difference. You're really working on keeping that whole connection throughout the body. It builds your core really, really strong. Gets to the point where you can add a heap of weight onto your arms and your legs. You can have like 25 kilos a side and make it really, really challenging. You can keep progressing it on and on. And then once you've mastered that, there's other progressions that move on, uh, more, more advanced versions, I suppose, that uh, I can show you down the track. But master the hollow tuck is an exercise that will change your core training forever. Hope you enjoy it.